Welcome to World War II Online Tutorials Basic Armor Operation. For your first time operating a vehicle, it's best to go to Cornered Rat Software, select Practice Offline, and then select Armor. Once there, you will find a list of vehicles available, and any and all vehicles will be available to you. Depending on which vehicle you have selected, you will have anywhere from two to four crew members available to you. Number one, the driver. Number two, the commander. Number three is the main gun, and number four is the hull gunner or machine gunner. Also, in some vehicles, there will be a loader in place of the hull gunner. Each position can have slight variations, so you should check those out while offline. The person who selects the vehicle and spawns in will always be the driver, whether you're multi-crewing or not. The driver is responsible for operating the vehicle. Some driver's positions only have slits and or hatches to look through. You can use the number pad 369741 to look around the inside and out through some of the side slits if it's one of the smaller vehicles. By pressing zero on the number pad, you can look at your instruments up close. The main portal in front of the driver's face is the one that opens and closes when you press the letter O. If it's a larger tank, then the driver's hatch will open and he can stick his head out and look around and get a better view. Pressing the period on the number pad will give you a zoomed view, either with optics or, if it's a smaller tank, without. Just like operating any vehicle in this game, pressing E will start the engine. W will apply power. Right and left brackets to up and down shift. A to turn left, D to turn right. Pressing S to stop. And as a driver, you have to pay attention to your terrain. Steep embankments or very sharp berms can be detrimental to your vehicle. Position number two is the commander or the captain of the vehicle. He sits in the top of the turret or in an extension of the turret called a cupola where he can look out through either window blocks or he can open the hatch and look around. Some cupolas don't have a hatch so the commander press O to open the viewport and then can use either zero to zoom in or a period to use the optics. Since the commander has the best view, he can guide the driver to safe locations, to either between a couple of berms to get a hull down position, or between bushes or in between trees to hide from the enemy air. The commander can then use his optics to look for enemy targets, either within cities or out in bush lines or in trees or other locations. Once a target has been spotted, then the commander can give the location to the gunner. Position three, the gunner. Some gunners have a small hatch located in the front of the turret, which can be opened and closed in order to listen for enemy targets when you're sitting still and being quiet. Pressing period on the number pad to bring up the optics and then right clicking on the mouse to fire a machine gun from the turret if one's available. The turret can be operated by using the mouse in the X direction. The gun can be elevated or depressed by using the mouse in the Y direction. The gun sight on some tanks is in a fixed position and cannot be ranged, while others have the ability to make adjustments to the range by using page up and page down keys. To fire the main gun, I left click the mouse. Note in the center of this particular reticle is a series of triangles with a larger one in the very center. That's what I use to aim with. Note that the sight line for the AP or armor piercing round goes from 500 meters up to 2400 meters, has a slightly flatter trajectory and that the AG line on the reticle, the inner one, goes from 400 up to 2800, but it has a greater adjustment to the sight because the high explosive round is much heavier and needs to be adjusted greater for further distance. Position 4, the co-driver slash hull gunner, and or if you don't have a hull gun, then it would be the loader in the vehicle. The hull gunner fires to the forward area to suppress infantry when the main gun is shooting in another direction. Thank you for watching this. World War II Online tutorial on basic armor operations.